Hello YouTube people, today I gonna show you two ultra cheap watches that have the same idea but executed in a different way. So let's take a better look and let's have some fun. This one is bigger watch but the basic idea is the same that minute hand, hour hand and seconds hand are actually wheels. Looks rather interesting and another watch is well basically the same underneath except it has this metal piece on the dial and the whole watch is a lot smaller. I'm not super excited about these watches but I appreciate the effort of uh, trying to make something different, something crazy. Let's check the quality control real quickly. How is the crown action? On this one it feels well dampened. Let's set on 45 minutes. It's, it feels super sensitive though. Well, when I push in the crown, nothing unusual. It jumps. Yeah, it jumps quite a lot. Little bit annoying. Yeah, and the crown is super sensitive. But anyway, it's just a toy. I don't like this red line. I wish the line was a little bit thinner and I wish it was black. The watch is rather big, rather chunky. But maybe because of that it doesn't have ticking sound. It muffles all the ticking sound. It, there is some audible sound but not annoying at all. This is basically the same except this one is smaller and it has this metal piece on, on top of the dial. Well, this is the dial, obviously. And how is the crown on this one? Oh. Um, nothing happened. Come on. Nothing happened. <laughs> Let me... <laughs> Hold on. It's fine. It's all under control. Let me fix it. Let me fix it. Come on, get back in place. Come on, get get back in place. Hold on a second. I will open the back. Okay, let's just put it back in place. Oh, I got it back in place. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. All good. We, we are all good. Take two. <laughs> so let's check the the crown action. How is how is the crown? Okay. Well, it it feels good. Well dampened crown, can't complain, but also minute hand, also very, very sensitive minute hand. Let's set in 45. Oh great, it doesn't work anymore. Mm, my bad, my bad, I guess I was a little bit too aggressive on the crown. Oh, oh well. <laughs> okay, anyway. <laughs> What do I do now? You know what I wanted actually to do is to take off this metal piece because I believe this watch would look better without this metal piece. So let's do that. Right, let's take everything out. Let's see how it looks like. Oh, this is nice. This is very interesting actually. What's this? Oh, that's some kind of fixation hole. Okay, let's take out the dial. Nicely sunburst dial hmm. looks rather interesting rather interesting let's try to put it in without that metal piece let's see if it stays in place well not really but i guess i guess the crown could hold it in place where is the crown oh here is the crown no it still doesn't work anyway let's put on the case back Oops, the, ca the crown just dropped out. Okay, never mind, never mind. Let's just take a look how it looks like, like so. Hmm. Rather interesting, but those holes are not nice right now. Yeah, those holes are those fixation holes from the dial. Anyway. Rather interesting approach. Interesting idea of a watch. Oh well, haven't avoided casualties this time, sorry about that. I, I believe that's my mistake, I was a little bit too rough on the crown. Uh, I don't blame the watch. Anyway, I hear you scream, destroy, destroy, smash them with a hammer. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that. I respect different approach to the design, trying to, to do something crazy. You have to respect that. So, 
where I gonna place them on my website thomaswatchview.com where it watches into different tier lists. They both go into no tier. I mean they are super cheap watches, I don't expect anything but they actually look and feel super cheap as well in person. I just, I can't really recommend them. If you want something really crazy with a strong novelty feel, I mean go for them of course, they are like toy watches but Anyway, they go into nope tier. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Goodbye.